Hello and welcome back, dear friends. It's me, Odo, and I'm back in my campaign of EU4 with Oman. <coughs> uh, last time we got two new provinces. Um, I just found out that we converted Sheer uh, to Ibadi because we uh, forced Abramut to convert to our religion, but instead of converting their new capital, they converted their old capital, now part of our country, which is good because we don't have to um, convert it anymore. So we just have to convert uh, Al-Qaeda. Um, yeah, we will not um, we will not fight Mahra now. We will just build a spy network on Barzangali. And try to get a claim on Mukala. And after we've got claim on Mukala, um, we will probably declare war on Barzangali. Um, with some luck, they are not, wait a minute, weren't they allied with the Mamluks before? Doesn't seem that they are allied with the Mamluks anymore, Adal, Pate, and Mahra. Where are the Mamluks? I mean, this will cost us some, um, this will cost some, what's it called, aggressive expansion if we make this deal with uh, Mahra annexing these two provinces, but I think it's better to do this this way. <clears throat> than to fight the, Mam the Timurids who have huge thousand troops. I mean, we are not in the position to fight the Timurids. We will have to go on slightly friendlier after that. But the next um, missions will lead us down. We gain another 100 admin points and trade efficiency and a claim on Mombasa, which is down there where we can get new um, Mombasa. There it is. Not sure if we get a claim on this whole region. Probably. Because if we have this region, we claim a claim on Zanzibar. Anyway, we probably have to to deal with Kilba and Malindi. Well, probably not Malindi, as it's in a fight with Vasangali. So probably with Vasangali again. <laughs> Anyway, <clears throat> I think this is the, the way to do. Now we just um, wait to get of our aggressive expansion down. Let's just drill. And... We still have extra here. No, we don't have military access. Not good. 
Uh, yeah, why not? Doesn't matter. Yeah, what we want to do now is to do some development here. Therefore, we need well meaning merchants. Would be good if their loyalty would be higher. Because um, with a higher get more bonuses. I believe if we have the merchants at 60%, we get plus 10% development bonus, but I am I really don't know how to get that. Um, or is it the Ulima? I don't think that it's the Ulima. Tax modifier, ah yeah, Ulima is stability and they are Development and they are, I don't know what. Yeah, above sixty percent. I'm pretty sure. already have the free enterprises. We could take this again to get their loyalty up. Uh, I really don't need this. Also do this already, but then we would give them some crown land. Ah, oh, we could take some crown land. Then they will hate us anyway. And again, we have some revolt. Okay. But it's just 3,000 people. Yeah. And our... Manus with um these are one so okay that's okay we won't get the bonus from the merchants uh where is this we are at 66 legalism i mean although everything i do <laughs> is going through mysticism we are still at 66 legalism is okay, I guess. <laughs> I mean, we probably shouldn't be too concerned about that. We have plus four point five percent, so we should should be able to convert Oman here. Oh, Al Qaeda here. Yeah, that's fine. Let's kill them. What's with Basangali? Ooh, we can do a reform. That's great. We can do noble privileges or noble privileges. What? Curtail noble privileges. National manpower modifier plus 15%. Hmm. Or national tax modifier. Hmm. We can't do this. Probably. Yeah. But 
for money is quite nice. Let's start. But we also need manpower to do our wars that will come. Hmm. Let's take the money first. So, and now let's put the button and then let's do a development edict here. And then let's develop muskets to gain some institution there. I mean, we won't be able to do it in the first run. I mean, we will do it mainly with military and diplomatic power. I really want to save up the admin power. So let's start with military because military we have a little less point. So now we are at 9%. Five percent and seven percent five. Ugh. One click here, okay? Only one click. Ooh. Expand Oman. This will give us more. Nah, we don't do this now. <laughs> of course not. We want to. Okay, 57%, that's okay. Just one there, okay. One. Uh, one or two clicks left. Soon, soon we will have the Renaissance. Only one or two clicks. And this we will take afterward. Great. Let's do the drilling. Make much more money now. Almost is no long longer a rival for us. Yay. Ooh, why not? Ah, because we did development stuff. Truth expired. Truth with almost expired. Yeah, too bad it's too late. I'm pretty sure they will lose both provinces to the Timurids now. I'm not sure why they, they are, ah, because there is still Sind in the war. Okay. It will probably not take it much longer. Uh, it will probably take some time. Do the same as before. Like mm, renting out troops to Hormuz to free Kavasir, and after doing that, declaring war on Hormuz. Hmm. At least Kavasir was him after the 
Timurids take Hormuz. Probably this could. Yeah. It's worth it for now. 120. Uh, Merchant Guild ex gains 10 influence, currently 91. Advisor cost minus 15%. That's nice. Or, oh, yeah, of course, we'll take this one. We need some new enemies. At least. Arden or Hansa. Arden seems not very, very poor in comparison to us. We even have a smaller navy than us. Hansa would also be great as they border us and we don't have a truce with them. Probably we should just attack them for the Humiliation. Hmm. Take Hassa first. They yeah, also nudged, nudged could come and help. We need two of them. Oh, really? Okay. What did I do? I took Arden and not Hassa. Okay. Now we have Hassa as well. And we have good money now. Great. Great, great, great. And I with Davasir and Baluchistan. <laughs> okay. Still allied with Sind. Hmm. How about I offer you Condottieri like this army? You would do it. You would even pay me some money for it. Hmm. Interesting. I could probably do this. I get some money. Stop dreading. Try to get Kavasir out of the clutches of the Timurids. Which should be done quite quickly. And then declare on Hormuz for Davasir. So the Timurids won't get a hundred percent score, so they can't take everything. Probably they even can't take Hormuz, which would be really, really great. Oh, come on. So 
So now let's see if this will. Ah, Synth won't help them. Take cover, Sim. Confirm. So they won't attack us anymore. We take cover, Sim, and everything's everything's fine. Ah, uh, I probably have to stop and let my cats out of mystery. <laughs> Katze! Go away! Stop it! Ah, uh, no! There soon will be something that. Mm, yeah. And something fell off. <laughs> okay. This seems interestingly. Interest, interestingly good. I think we can even go back to Driddle. I mean, do it anyway, because I don't think that uh, Hormuz is uh, having an army. They don't have any army. They just have a few fleets left. That's good. With some weird luck. I mean, what could happen is that they get uh, vassalized by the Timurids. Mm -hmm. yeah, we just have to wait. This will be fine. Everything will be fine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'll eat some chocolate in between. We can can use Muslim piety interaction. What's a Muslim piety interaction? Your tradition of legalism is a great advantage in forcing faithful adherents will move us by 50 towards mysticism, but impact corruption by minus two. Oh, oh wow, this is nice. So with high mm. mysticism, I can gain manpower. Mm -hmm. And with high legalism, we can oh wait a bit we can make money out of that because when when we debase currency we get money and we can put it back as we are not doing anything with that high legalism okay it, it gives us more uh, more tax more manpower, less technology cost, more loyalty for the Ulima, but less loyalty for the Dimi. Um, yeah, we probably should do this. Just debase the currency, get some money, and get rid of the of the 
or option. Good. <clears throat> good, very good. Mm -hmm. So let's go back to improve relations with the Mamluks. Best to do some more diplomatic power there, diplomatic click there. Submit to the Iman, move quickly towards legalism and gain legitimacy. I mean, we could do this again, I believe. <laughs> Um, or um, oh yeah, why not? Oh, what well, I said in there, I didn't read it. So we have got some some money. Yes, that's good. We can build some stuff and, and marketplaces. Marketplace could be right ni nice like there because um, we have also ports here. So, marketplace will be nice, but there is already a marketplace, so we won't need it here. There are also some ports here. Nah. How about there? No, there is no port. Ah, I see. We already have conquered the land. Okay, me. At least we hindered the Timurids on crossing the Straits of Hormuz. <laughs> Black news indeed. Why that? Oh no. Did my did my ruler die? And we have a regency. But she was better than the ruler anyway. Too bad. But it's not really important. And he's already 10, so he will take over. And he's even better than his mother with one point in admin skill. That's okay. Seem we probably should build a fort here. Gain the money. Can we get something else? Nah. I mean, we could tell him to revoke course. Take him as a as a vessel. Although he doesn't have any cores anymore, so it doesn't matter. Let's do it like that. This will give us some. Um, Nothing and will bring us some prestige at least for the mascot thing. So we will gain a bit more prestige there. 
6.6. Yeah, that's okay. I can live with that. Let's go with this. I mean, I'm not sure if we want the fort here. At least the fort here or here would be great. Where do we want the fort? Probably, if we have it here, we can build a fort. So we have a fort chain here. And then we need a fort in Mukala. What do we have for you know? Well, so here will be a nice place for Okay. Let's improve the region again. Hassa, Hassa, Hassa. What do you do? Really? You want me as your enemy? That's not a good move. So let's see. Ooh, we can build another ship. That's great. Um, we can have 17 ships and 15 troops. Nice. So let's build another park. And... Ah, yeah. My king died. That's not good, I believe. Yeah, can't do anything about it. Then let's... So it's 11, 15. I think it's 15. 15 it was, yeah. Three more troops. Ooh, fancy. Mm-hmm. Of sixteen percent in almost this is not good. We need at least four more percent there. Hmm. I'm not sure how to get this. Probably would have to conquer the land here like modern. If it's port or this base or submit. Or Djibouti. There is a fort there. So many places we want to we want to expand. So come back there. I want to see if I can a 
attack you now without the Timrits? Nah. Of course not. Why would it be like that? So, Muscat. Ah, uh, of course not. So we have the and we can embrace Renaissance. Yay, we are so great. And now let's fulfill this mission and get some Nazca. That's great. So this is a really great plate now. Good, good, that's really good. Can we get another advisor? Yeah, we would get a one. <sighs> if we'd get this to 20%. We need more ships. We don't get more ships. Because we lack the sailors. Do you give us trade power? Yes. Hmm. Would be great if I'd find someone else giving me trade power like you. You are hostile towards me. Why on earth is that? Would you give it to me? Hmm. Let's see what's up to here. So this is the last one. Nudge run. How about you? No, would we'll do that. Hmm. Ethiopia probably not. Adal? Yeah, of course not. Medri Bari. Can we? See this here, like one thing, like transfer trade, offer vassalization, offer knowledge sharing. Ooh, we could offer much knowledge sharing. They would give us a bit of money. Wait, if we... <laughs> this would be a lot of money. If we would get the Ottomans or the Mamluks to be our friends. Come on, do you want to be my ally? Nah, of course not. How about you? Hmm... More probable, but not really. Hmm. Yeah, well, let's transfer it. Let's transfer it to 
nudged. Why not? I mean, it's better than nothing. Returning scholars. They will make a welcome addition to the conference. With 10 towards legalism and 10 admin. Legitimacy. Who needs that? Asa is no longer a valid rival of Oman. That's great. So now we are at 61 power projection. This is great. Because, because we now gain that power. Hmm. Let's try to get some forty cents on that for five. How about now? Team Ritz, why would you would you defend them? I mean really. Why are they moving there? They're not allied with the Nemlooks. It doesn't stand here that they are I mean that they are protected. Mamluks. Okay. Mamluks are not guaranteeing them, are they? They're guaranteeing the independence of something. Probably they are the defender of the faith. That could be. Can we see the defenders of the faith? Country, religion. Yeah, yeah, they are. Mamluks are defenders of the Sunni faith. Oof. This will be hard. This is the reason why they would defend them. Interesting. So you are probably not Sunni. Yeah, you are. But the Mamluks won't defend you, why not? Hmm. Probably because I have a cat belly. Can, can this be? Not sure. Still a plus of 1.33. Could probably prove some development here as well. Oops, wait a bit. Let's get a claim on Mukara. Hmm. 
Let's interpretations with you again. So, how about if I declare war on you now? Mamluks would still help them out. Hmm. Pretty interesting. How about then? Do the Timurid still help you? Yup. Still on the helping side, so no possibility to attack you. How about you? Ooh, not sure to help us on land. We probably could give them some land there as well. And we have a claim through our nice vessel Leva. We probably could give Bunny just to Leva and take some land for our set. Not hard to do it before. I mean, it's just Massa and Dallas here. And we really could give Nudge something. Tassa and Dallas here would be preoccupied with something else before they attacked us. Hmm. But we will have to. Remove this. Oof. Before we do that, because then we couldn't ask for any yards. Should we do that? Eh. Probably. Go down to Dallas here and crush them. And with Dallas here, we get some trade power. We probably get with this trade power up to our 20%. I'm not sure if we get it, but probably. Who knows? Normally, Dallas here should have some trade power here as well. Does he have some trade power here? Yeah, there he is. He has. Not really trade power. 0 0.04. Sure. But they have a, a merchant there. So with the merchant. Yeah, why not? Do they have any forts there? Just, ugh, it's a level three fort. Ugh. Need 9,000 men to <coughs> siege that. Give these two to nudged, this to Yas, and these two to us. Yeah, something like that. 
Let's see, he might run. Let's see, four. They have just 5,000 troops. I mean, what should happen? What would go wrong? Really? If our own troops stay here, you go forth to Tsufba. Are you going to Qatar? That way we can get you there. Come on. And kill some Dalasirian troops. Ooh, 4,000 health bars. That's okay. You can stay there. Yay. Notched. Don't work. This is the reason why we've got you as an ally. Okay, I will stop here for today because I played long enough. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you tune in next time when we're here with Oman. Until then, see you. Bye.